So you've just launched the uh, RX One R Mark II. Yeah. Um, this is a, a consumer, high-end consumer camera, stroke second camera for professionals. Can you tell me um, what's what's changed between this and the original RX One? Well, one uh, great improvement is uh, image quality. It has uh, newly has a 42 megapixel high-resolution full-frame sensor, which is a backside illuminated. Uh, illuminated. And, and this is the same sensor as A7R Mark II, right? Okay, but in a in a smaller body with with a, a dedicated lens. Dedicated uh, size uh, tester lens, and then uh, it's newly got worse for as the variable Lopez filter, optical Lopez filter. Okay, so this is the bit that's never been seen before anywhere. Right. Um, can you explain for those people who don't know? I mean, why is this significant? What, what does it do, and, and how does it work? Yeah. Well, with the variable Lopez filter, you can change the filter effect between on and off, and you newly get the standard mode, so you can uh, adjust the filter effect level depending on your purpose. And, and the idea of the low-pass filter is to essentially optimize the output for different levels of moiré. Um, mm -hmm. um, and so traditionally some photographers like images that mm -hmm. appear very sharp, but as a side effect there's some moiré, and other people prefer it to be softer. Right. So you're now allowing people to choose... Yeah, you can choose either like high resolution or less moiré, as you like. Okay. And for now, this is limited to, to photos. Uh, what happens in video mode? Does it actually have any impact on the video mode? It's only photo. I would assume that in the future, uh -huh. in, this, the future in this technology may be uh -huh. applicable, adaptable to work uh -huh. um, with, with different resolutions in, in video. But anyway, that's just me yeah, just guessing. seriously take note. <laughs> <laughs> okay. So I know this isn't a video camera, but some videographers do like to carry one of these as a, as a point and shoot stills camera and occasionally a grab video camera. Um, does this have any of the other video features from the A7 series? Video mode you can get full HD 60p and with XAVCS format it goes up to 50 megabps which is really high rate. Does this have S-Log or anything like that? Uh, it doesn't have any like, brand new video functions because we're totally focusing on how much we can improve on the photo functions and also we're prioritizing downsizing of the camera body. But there's no S-Log 2 in no here? S -log. S -log 3. Okay, so for now, this is it's basically a high-end photo camera, but the technology that you're showing has hopefully some promise for, for the, maybe the next generation or the generation after that of alpha cameras. Let's, oh, let's... I can't promise that, <laughs> but I will again seriously take note with okay. that. Okay, thank you very much. Thank you very much.